here is the shaper that uh, that I've uh, that we put together to basically it's going to be used to uh, shape this mold here. Remember, I made one and it didn't come out right. Here's here's part of that pattern, and um, then I made a second one and it was pretty close to really good. And so I just took the one and I nailed it to the other one and I just copied these two because it turned out to be a little bit extra on there so I said okay well, let's just copy this and now they're both good ones but I needed a full 18 inches to go across because it's going to be an 18 inch mirror and of course what this does this board this piece across the top it keeps it from fall, just keeps it level and then uh, keeps it up at the surface now it's not going to be a perfect circle all I want to do is get something close and when I get something close, I'm going to go in with a grinder and smooth it out the way they do the real mirrors in real life. Okay, so uh, right now I'm just um, adding sand because we're a little bit low on this thing. So add a little bit of sand to this thing, which is basically going to be the mold here. And to help shape all this thing. Here's some. Um, let me level this here and I'll show you what I'm going to do. Now it looks like it's starting to get pretty close to being about level. Yeah, it's. I could, I could have taken a piece of plastic that from around the house, that, but right now I just want to be able to shape this, this, uh, the sand here. Which is what what I'm doing, I'm making a sand castle <laughs> of sorts. Okay. So that's a little bit of water in there that uh gets that to settle down a little bit. And what this'll do is it'll make it drop down a little bit. I might end up doing this five or six times before I get it right. We'll have to see. Do a little bit of pre-shaping. Alright, so we got Scrape in here a little bit, but I think it needs, uh, <clears throat> needs to be brought down a little bit with some more water. But would have made this whole business a little bit easier because keeping this in the middle is not too easy. So, of course, pull it out and take some of the excess out. I think we're almost ready to pour the mold, but pour the uh, pour the base for the mirror. Okay. Thanks for watching my program. If you like my videos, be sure and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Have a great day.